Hello everyone, this is SK. Today I'm going to share a basic tip in Microsoft Excel. So let's go to start, run and type it as Excel. I'm using Microsoft Excel 2003 and this tip will work in all versions of Microsoft Excel, including the latest one, 2010. So the topic we are going to see today is how to insert or delete rows and columns using keyboard shortcut. To understand this, let's see a demo. As you can see, I have quite a few names here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six rows and three columns, A, B, and C. Say if I want to insert a column, sorry, insert a row right in between the fourth and fifth row, all I have to do is to make sure that I have selected any one of the cells in the fifth row and then hold on the shift key and press spacebar on my keyboard to select that entire row. And after that, hold on the control key and then press the numpad plus button on my keyboard to insert a row. Similarly, you can insert a column. Say if I want to insert a column right in between the B and C column. All I have to do is to make sure that I have selected any one of the cells in the C column, then hold on to the control key and then press space bar to select that entire column. Again hold on to the control key and then press the numpad plus button to insert a column. If I want uh, two more columns, again I will hold on to the control key and press the numpad plus button twice. One, two. So we have uh, entered two more columns right now. And moving on, if I want to delete a column or delete a row first, say I want to delete the fourth row, Joel, Michael and Ben. All I have to do is to make sure that I have selected any one of the cells in the fourth row and then hold down the shift key and press spacebar to select the entire row and then hold down the control key and press the minus button on the numpad to delete that entire row. You can also delete an entire column. Say I want to delete the A column. All I have to do is to make sure that I have selected any one of the cells in the A column and then hold down the control key and press space bar to select that entire column. Again hold down the control key and press the numpad minus key to delete that particular column. So this is how you insert or delete rows and columns in Microsoft Excel using the keyboard shortcut. So to summarize this, let's go to the bullet points and recap whatever we have learned so far. We have functions and keyboard shortcut key combinations. To select an entire row, hold on the shift key and press space bar. To insert an entire row, hold on the control key and then press the numpad plus button. To delete an entire row, hold on the control key and press the numpad minus button. To select an entire column, hold on the control key and then press the space bar. To insert an entire column, hold on the control key and then press the numpad plus button. To delete an entire column, hold on the control key and then press the numpad minus button. Hope this video helps. You all have a great day.